Hi, I'm Claire from The Kitchy Kitchen, and this is 10 Second Living, where I show you how to do practically anything in 10 seconds or less. And today, I'm gonna show you how to make my version of burgers. I love burgers, they're so delicious, especially as a barbecue staple. They are such a great summertime meal. And today, I'm actually gonna be doing a brisket banh mi burger. So all the ideas I'm talking about can be applied to any burger you make, but I love these flavors going on. So the brisket is a really rich meat, and I ground this up myself. You can check out how to grind that in a previous video. And I have a spice rub that I'm going to be mixing into the brisket. And so for that, I have one tablespoon of sugar, one and a half teaspoons of kosher salt, one and a half teaspoons of freshly ground pepper, one and a half teaspoons dry mustard, and one and a half teaspoons chili powder. So lots of fabulous flavors going on here. A little bit of sweet, a little bit of salt, really nice. And then I have banh mi toppings. So for that, I have just classic ones that you'd find on any banh mi. I have mayonnaise, jalapeno, carrot, cucumber, cilantro, and of course, sriracha. So lots of fresh, really fun flavors going on. So let's get started. Mix the spice rub with ground brisket. Form into three quarter inch patties about four inches wide. Grill over medium high heat about four minutes aside. Spread mayo on buns and top with garnishes. My burger is done. It smells so good in here. Oh my gosh, I love burgers. So I cannot wait to give this a try. Mmm, that is so good. Oh my gosh. I love the combinations of flavors here. The brisket is really rich, and the meat itself, the burger, is super duper flavorful. So it goes wonderfully with fresh cucumber, crunchy carrot, really bright, herbaceous cilantro. This is amazing together. However, if you were just gonna eat this with like lettuce, tomato, ketchup, that kind of thing, the meat would actually probably overpower it, so then I would have the spice mixture. But if you're gonna do a banh mi style, that level of flavor is really fantastic with all of these ingredients. For the full recipe, check out the description under this video and my blog, thekitchykitchen.com. Mm -hmm.